Hello friends, happy Tuesday. So like I said yesterday, this week we're learning all about fish. So today I thought it would be so fun to make an under the sea sensory bottle. So here I have all my supplies, right? I have my water bottle. I have my food coloring. I have my vegetable oil. And for this special sensory bottle, I have some little fish toys that I'm gonna put in it so that it looks like we're looking in the aquarium. So the first thing I'm gonna do is fill up my water bottle halfway with water from the sink. All right, so I have my water. Next, I'm gonna add my food coloring. What color is this? What color is the ocean? It's blue. So I'm gonna put some drops of blue food coloring in there. Let's count. One, two, three, four. Let's see if that'll be enough. All right, now I'm gonna take my vegetable oil or my canola oil and I'm gonna pour that, in, but I'm gonna leave a little bit of space at the top. I don't wanna fill it all the way. You see the bubbles that it's making? You see all the bubbles? That's like the bubbles in the ocean. All right, now is the fun part. I'm gonna put all my little fishies in there. So first, I have this little guy. This is called a hammerhead shark. Now I have another shark. This is a blue shark. And I have one more shark. This one is the color black. Next. What animal is this? This is an octopus. I'm gonna put my octopus in there because they live in the sea also. And this is a cool animal called a stingray. They live in the ocean with the fish too. I'm gonna put him in there. You know what this animal is. What animal is this? This is a turtle. Great job. And last, I have this super cool little fish. He's the color orange and I love that he has a super big fin on top. So I'm gonna put them all in there. I'm gonna put my cap on super tight. And I'm gonna shake it back and forth. And if you look, you can see all of my animals swimming around in my ocean. And I can see the bubbles. It's almost like waves crashing back and forth. You see all the animals in there that are swimming around? Whoa. So I would love if you guys could try this at home. I think you would have so much fun with it. And you can add as many animals as you want. Even if you don't have any animals, you can make your bottle look like the ocean like I did. And you can watch it go back and forth and you can watch the waves crashing. So if you make a sensory bottle like me, I would love to see a picture of it or a video of you playing with it. And I hope you have lots of fun. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Have a good day, friends.